Okay. Ba 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 ba. Hello 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 hello. Wait, why isn't my thingy moving? Ba 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 ba. Hello hello hello. Ah. Wait, why isn't my thingy moving? Okay. 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 Shush. 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 Wait, I gotta figure this out. Why is this uh? Ba 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 ba. Microphone device. Da 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 da. Okay. There we go. It had, um, yeah, it had changed. That was really weird. Okay. Testing, test. Okay, yeah. Everything else is fine. Hello. Also, I'm changing the music. This is way too intense. Go to the previous one. Yeah. Ah, <sighs> hello. I hope everybody is having a good day today. Uh,. Uh, it's a it's a chill chill Monday chill Monday. Um, hope everyone's doing well. Uh, it's nice to let the battle begin. What ba oh the <laughs> Final Fantasy VII? It'll it'll switch to that after the song again. Um, it just needs to play out this one again, because I wanted something quiet to begin with. Uh, da -da -da -da. I just need to get up. So I'm doing another shark today. Another shark TF. Um, I am just going to try and find what the shark wanted. The person who's becoming the shark. Oh, uh, where are they? Reading, reading through what I need to need to draw. Howdy, kind of can chat. Hello. Okay, I have finished reading. I just had to uh, familiarize myself with what I was doing. Yet again. And then blow my nose. Now my cat is staring at me. Hello, Mishka. She's loafing in the corner, like in the opposite corner of the room and staring at me. Oh, she's walked away. Bye, Mishka. Okay, now you've got Final Fantasy. Okay. Okay. 
Yeah, that'll do. So, what we're doing today is a three panel shark tier sequence. I'm not going to be able to do the entire thing in one day. Um, so, this will probably take a couple of streams. But that's. We have fun here. But we have fun here, we do that. Excuse me, please paste. Copy image, paste, thank you. There we go. This is the reference, this is who's going to be TF'd today. Um, I'll put this like over here, because I'll be working on the first panel. Sequence hype. Yeah, it's pretty good. I also need to oh it's black tip shock. They're turning into a black tip shock today. Uh, let me find that. Yeah, this is apparently the Wikipedia image for black tip shock. <laughs> Well, that works for me. Merge layers, refs, why not? Okay. Oh, where's my other chat gone? I just realized my other chat isn't there. Give me a sec. Uh, here we go. Shork. Oh, hey, Kyrie. I am doing Shork today. What has been going on in your world? Uh, yeah. something like this do something like this. I really like the most recent picture you posted that's yeah, gonna be like a fucking power move like a fucking fucking power move the one you posted five minutes was it really five minutes ago that's funny I just, I checked FA to announce my stream and there was a picture in my inbox. So I guess it was the one that was five, five minutes ago. It's good. Like 15 minutes, but still nice. Yeah. I was wondering why it didn't have any comments on it. I guess that makes sense. I never check these things. Um, I may just, I may do something that I haven't really done before, and I'm gonna just block out the poses all at once, and then. Um, put in the detail later. I haven't really done that before, but I really want to have like a full, I want to have a full blocking done first before I start adding, before I start going granular. I hope you don't mind, Kyrio, but I was accidentally giving you uh, Picato Premium for like three months and I didn't realize. So I have turned it off, I apologize. <laughs> but I didn't realize that it gave it to you like months in a row. I thought it just gave it to you for one month. So <laughs> I had to unsubscribe because I was like, where's all my, mo where's all my money going?
Firebird dashes, just redeem stretch. Can do. Oh geez, I'm sorry, I'll reimburse you if you No. It's fine. It was my it was my fault. It's totally fine. It, it like don't need to reimburse for anything. I'm just letting you know that like <laughs> I've turned it off. <laughs> it was only like 28 bucks. It's fine. I'm gonna stretch. Okay, I stretched. Um, yeah, thank you, Firebird Dashes. I don't think I've seen you here before. It's nice to have you here. If you say so, thanks for doing it in the first place. No worries. It's my pleasure. Ba, 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 ba. Okay. Let's get back to this. I gotta readjust to my comfy position. When I draw, I, I, I sit like... I sit like, in my chair, I sit like L from Death Note. When I'm drawing. I'm fucking hunched over. Colgara battle. Oh, this is the weird cover that doesn't sound very good that I keep saying that I'm going to remove from the playlist. Like, it sounds great at first, but the like it's so anticlimactic when it ends. I guess it's because the actual... I don't think the actual song has an ending, because it's a boss theme. I don't remember. Yeah, like, the song would just end like that. Ugh. I'm on Elden Ring DLC. Tears of the Kingdom did not fill the hole that Elden Ring left when I, when I finished it. How's that gonna look? Wait, I need to draw this in reverse. Is this like, is what I'm drawing like a Pokemon or something? I've, I feel like I've seen this design before. <clears throat> I'm not sure. Okay, this needs to be rotated slightly. There we go.
Okay, potion goes there. Ish. Hand goes there. Ish. Fuck. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> You ever just draw something and you like freak out a little bit because you're like, actually, I don't, <laughs> don't know what the fuck I'm doing. <laughs> oh, it's fine. We have fun here. We have fun here. So if I remember correctly, this song's about to end and it's going to end on the most unsatisfying note you've ever heard. Wait for it. Yeah, that's it. That's the fucking end of it. Oh. I'm going to remove it right now from my playlist. Where is it? Where did it go? What's it called? It's called Colgara Battle. Where is it? Oh, okay. It's right there. Remove from this playlist. Fuck. I've taken you away. Bum bum bottom. It's not that bad, yeah. Well, I, I, I know it's not that bad, but I can't, I, I'm gonna keep complaining about it until I get rid of it, so I just may as well get rid of it. Because it's the only thing I can concentrate on when it's, when it's playing, is, is how gross it is. And I, I, I apologize to the per whoever wrote it because, you know, writing music is is a big thing and it takes a lot of effort, but sometimes, sometimes the effort just, just doesn't pay off. <laughs> I'm sure other people love that song. I'm sure other people love that particular cover of that song. It just ain't for me. Just like, just like how a lot of people love Tears of the Kingdom. But I don't, because <laughs> I think it's, sh I think it's a little bit shit. I think it's a little bit shit in the story department and in the and in the world design department. And I know it took a lot of effort to make that game, and I'm not undermining that. But I think they could have, I think they really could have done better. I really do. I feel like if I directed. Tears of the Kingdom, it could have been, you know, if if I had the if I had the knowledge of the fuse mechanic, I could have written a much more engaging story than the than the one that it, I've talked about this before, and I'm not going to talk about it again. We're going to stop it there because it's going to we're going to do it for the rest of the stream. We're going to be talking about Tears of the Kingdom for the rest of the stream, and nobody wants that. Anyway, speaking of Tears of the King, <laughs> it's got good music though. I fucking love the music. Like, um, that particular cover of the Colgara Battle, uh, I don't like, but the actual piece of music that was written for the game is fucking spectacular. The, Col the Colgara Battle is probably my favorite boss battle in the game, to be honest. Even though it's like mostly a gimmick fight. Potion TF? Hell yeah. Kynik. Hey, Jay.
What's up? I said I was going to block them all out before being granular. I should really do that. But I need to do this first, actually. Yip, 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 yip. Hey, Baki, you know. I can use my yip emotes. Good morning to you. How are you doing on this fine morning? Get some good rest. Um, my rest was good until my cat woke me up this morning. Like, just... She wanted to feed, and like, that's fair enough. But then after I fed her, she just decided to start rummaging around in my room and throwing stuff off of shelves. And I'm like, dude, not today. Not today. So I took her, and I put her in her mum's room. Um, and that's where she stayed for the rest of the morning. I need to save this real quick. Um, season of sharks. Number 11. Okay, there we go. Yeah, they got three fingers. But yeah, like overall, my rest was fine. Um, it was okay. Good to hear. Shark TF today? Yep. Black tip shark. A three panel black tip shark. Okay. Panel one's blocked. Panel two. I need to blow my nose again real quick. Black tips are pretty cool. Yeah. I think they're cute. I like their big eye. Something is fishy about this. Panel one to panel two. Exactly, Jason. Exactly. Neon, give me a sec. Uh. sippy I had a little a little refresh of my of my brain let's do this oh wait how did they describe they wanted to see a certain way Uh. 
Right, okay. That's what they want. Yeah, this has got like a... I know I'm concentrating real hard on this right now. Blah. Believe it or not, I actually don't know how stairs are put together. So I'm just kind of making this shit up. I don't even know if it's any good. I love Dark Souls OST, the Osiris boss OST is my favorite. I can play that. I actually haven't heard that in since I played the game. Osiris the Consumed King. Little Dragon TF Man. You gonna play an ad? Please don't play an ad. Okay, I think. This is pretty good. finished Dark Souls 3 like five times. <laughs> I've only ever finished all of them once. I finished Dark Souls 1, 2, 3, Demon Souls Remake, uh, Bloodborne, all once. I finished them all one time. I'm working my way through my second Elden Ring playthrough, which I never thought would happen. But I really fucking love Elden Ring.
Yeah, good shit. Actually, you know what I really love? You know what I really love? Ludwig's theme. The Accursed and Holy Blade. Ah, that's a lie, actually. I did finish Bloodborne twice. I forgot. I have- I did play it again, through again with a friend. Bloodborne's the only one so far that I finished twice. It is absolutely my favorite Souls game. Like, by a wide margin. <laughs> it's also the first one that I played. I had a friend, um who really liked souls. Oh, fucking amazing. Yeah, I had a friend who- well, I still have a friend who really likes souls uh, games. And he's been playing them way longer than I have. And I wanted to get into souls games during quarantine because I was bored. And um, I was like, so which one should I start with? Should I start with Dark Souls 1? And he was like, don't start with Dark Souls 1. <laughs> start with Bloodborne. And you might think that that's like a weird answer because Bloodborne's one of the hardest ones, but I actually really appreciate him for getting me to start with Bloodborne because it was the hardest one to start with. And um, after Bloodborne, like after I finished Bloodborne, like Bloodborne was a, a slog to get through, but I actually really enjoyed getting through it because I like pushing myself to be patient with myself. Um, and he knows that as well. Like it's, it's, not, it's definitely not for everyone to start with. Um, but for me, it was the perfect one to start with. And um, we played through Bloodborne together. And uh, we we didn't always, we didn't do multiplayer at all. We just like, he basically, we played it simultaneously. And as I progressed through the game, he like waited for me in an area and he like shared his screen, his uh, PlayStation screen with me. It was great. Um, and, uh, after I finished Bloodborne, I felt extremely accomplished, uh, especially after I finished the DLC, which I played before any Souls games. I went straight from the game to the DLC, uh, and then just before I started Dark Souls 1, I defeated, uh, the fetus baby monster that I can't remember the name of right now. Bloodborne. Fetus boss. What's the fetus boss called? Orphan of Kos. Which was the hardest fucking boss in Bloodborne by far. Um, you think DS- you thought DS2 was the hardest? I think DS2 is the most tedious, but I don't think it's the hardest. I think the hardest Souls game is Bloodborne. <laughs> uh, and I don't think Sekiro counts as a Souls game. But I do think Sekiro is harder than Bloodborne. But yeah. Uh, finished Orphan of Kos, and then my next port of call was to play Dark Souls 1, and it was so much easier. <laughs> I was very, I was very happy that my friend got me to play Bloodborne first, because it made everything else way easier. <laughs> Although I still really struggled with Ornstein and Smoke in Dark Souls 1. But that was kind of the only part I really got stuck on. Uh, everything else was pretty simple. And then the next time I got stuck was in Dark Souls 2, in the Iron Keep. Uh, it wasn't actually any particular boss that I got stuck on, it was just the run to the boss in the Iron Keep. Which is un just disgustingly hard. It's just not even fair. Because um, you just get shot by a billion arrows, and you can't fucking do anything. So I did the thing that you, they let you do in Dark Souls 2, where like, if you kill an enemy 12 times in a row, then they stop spawning. So I just spent an entire, like, 
like two or three hours just going through and killing all of the enemies in the Iron Keep until it was completely empty. And then I could just run to the boss scot free. Um, that that was just disgusting. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Oh, I forgot to draw his tail in the first panel. I should probably do or their tail in the first panel. Um, but the hardest boss for me after, um, Orphan of Cause was actually all the way in Dark Souls 3. So I had gone through Dark Souls 1 and 2 by the time I got to Dark Souls 3, and everything was relatively simple. Like, I got through the whole game, I played through the DLC, and I was about to get to the final boss, and then my friend showed me, the same friend who introduced me to Bloodborne, showed me the um, the like secret dragon area in Dark Souls 3, which is freaking cool. Um, I think it's called Arch Dragon Peak, I think. Um, I can't actually remember what it's called. But yeah, it's like a secret area where it's like a bunch of dragons in there. And the, the final boss of that area is uh, the Nameless King. Uh, and after being after like practically skipping through Dark Souls 3 because it was that easy for me, I got fucking slaughtered by the Nameless King. It took me so long. I was like, what the hell? Why is this guy so much harder than the rest of the game? He was so, so hard for me. I did not, like it got to the point where I was not having fun on the Nameless King. So, for me, hardest bosses in the main Soul series are, uh, yeah, Nameless King, uh, Orphan of Co uh, Orphan of Cos- Yeah, Medea, I did beat Medea, and it wasn't that bad for me. I thought it was a long slog every time I had to, like, fight him, but it didn't leave as much of an impact. Medea was fine for me. It was just kind of annoying. But the Nameless King, for whatever reason, just fucked me up real bad. And I got so angry. I did beat Medea. Oh, I didn't- you know who I didn't beat? Who I never beat, actually, because I didn't know he existed? Was, um... Alameet. In Dark Souls 1's DLC. I never actually attempted that boss. Because I didn't know it existed. I knew you could shoot him down, but I didn't know you could actually go and fight, fight him until I'd already moved on. And then I never ended up going back. I should probably do that.
Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I don't know if it really portrays losing balance, but whatever.
I return from the the great beyond. The beyond of five five seconds ago, of of a couple of minutes ago. That 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 beyond. I need to move the border because I don't have enough room. Uh, I'm also going to move these just over here, and then I'm going to move this like this. And then, wait, uh, move that and that like that. There we go. That's what I want. Border line up one, line up two, lock. And then zoom in, move, zoom out. You can't fucking. Line up three. Welcome back, Kynik. Welcome back, indeed. Ah, oh, hello Raz. I think I know I think I know who you are. Thank you for following. <laughs> nice to have you on a stream. You made it finally. Oh my goodness. It's nice to have you. Making a shark TF today. Three panel shark TF that I'm definitely gonna have to move. Like, I'm gonna have to um, do this over a couple of streams. Oh. <laughs> Hazel has some great emotes. Subathon 24-7 stream? Oh my god. 
like, do you want me to do a stream that, like, lasts a whole day? Or a whole week? I don't understand what that is. What is this subathon 24-7? Explain it to me. Because there are so many assumptions that I could make about a subathon 24-7 stream. Each sub slash follow slash gift adds time, and you start with about 24 hours. Some streamers will play reruns when they sleep and eat, while others just pause the time. That sounds like... exhausting. <laughs> that sounds exhausting. I don't know if I could do that. Um, especially since I don't really have that much time. I usually stream for about two hours before work in the morning, and then I've got to head to work. I think maybe if I was on like a vacation and I decided that I wanted to stream all vacation, then maybe. But um, I don't have that. I don't have the luxury of time. <laughs> I also think it would kill me. I think I would actually, like, be so burnt out by the end, it would be unreal. I mean, this is assuming that people would actually sub, right? Um, but I... You know the scary thing? I'm scared that they will. So... I think I've seen one last month or so. These are, like, the creators who only get revenue from streaming slash content creation. Um... I know that Onpako does a lot of like subathon things, because uh, he gets, at the moment, he's getting a lot of his revenue from streaming. Um, but his are cool. He does bitrate reduction streams, which are like you pay his Kofi, and then every dollar is like a one kilobit taken away from the bitrate of the stream until it becomes unwatchable. I think that's really funny. What would you even, what would you want to see if I did, what would you want to see if I did um, a subathon stream? Because I wouldn't want to draw the whole time, I would hurt my wrist. What else would you want me to do? I'm curious. Just in general, what would people be interested in seeing me do on stream? I do have plans to play video games on stream. Because I think that it, people have asked for that before. And I'm happy to do that. But what else? I'm interested. It could be anything. More shark. <laughs> Scary games, survival games, etc. I'm gonna be real, it's gonna be very hard to scare me. I am very immune to scary games. But maybe that's interesting. Maybe maybe someone like who's not very scared by scary games playing them would be an interesting thing to watch because I feel like a lot of people really hype up how scared they get by scary games. Lethal Company? Well, I don't really have any uh, I don't really have anybody to play Lethal Company with. So, I don't know if that would be interesting. I don't think single player Lethal Company would be that cool. 
Have I seen the Zoocosis trailers? No. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> but hey, Bradley. Nice to have you on stream. I'll send it on Telegram later. Okay. Power World, I'm not playing that because uh, it was made by a company that supports uh, scraping artists' work with generative AI and then monetizing it. I do not want to support that. Also, Power World was made with like, like, like some people's fan art as well who aren't getting credited so yeah i don't want to support that um and also i encourage other people to not support it as well I'm good. Uh, I feel that I'm never online at the right amount of time or available to do multiplayer stuff. Yeah, I mean, I also just don't... I don't know if anybody that I, like... If... What's gonna happen is I'm gonna go onto, like, a server full of people that I'm friends with, and I'm gonna be like, hey, does anyone want to play Lethal Company? And then people are gonna go, no, I'm busy. And then it's good. that's gonna be that. <laughs> uh... So, yeah. That's why I don't really... That's why I don't really, like, stream with many people. I know other, other TF streamers like to do, um, like, collabs and stuff, but I feel like I have asked for collabs for... Other oh, stream, ah, uh, maybe, I don't know. Maybe I just need to be more confident. I don't know. I only got 15 viewers. Hello, everybody. Be willing to try Lethal Company with you, but I'm a scaredy cat. I mean, I'd be happy to play it. I, Lethal Company literally does not provoke any fear response in me. Like, I've played it with some friends a couple of times. They will be screaming, and I'm just like, yep. There's always those Mega Sunday TF art jams. They are at 4 a.m. my time. I can't be a part of them. <laughs> there was one last night for me. That was at 4.57 in the morning. There is no way that I'm going to do that on a Monday morning at 4 a.m. before work. <laughs> Just record a few hours of you drawing and play it. That would be disingenuous. But yeah, look, if I if I find enough people to play Lethal Company with, then I'd love to. But I just worry that um that I'm not going to. So Make a Kobold army so there's always a Kynik readily available to stream at all hours. There is only one Kynik. That is me. All other Kyniks are not the Kynik. And only I, only I am allowed to be Kynik. No one else can stream as Kynik. I mean, if, if Grub wanted to stream on my channel, then I would let them. Um, but they definitely are not going to want to do that. Also, Grub doesn't play video games, so <laughs> I can't play Lethal Company with them either. 
if I scheduled the gaming session and people would show up to play? I doubt it. I doubt it. I've done that before and it hasn't worked. But, you know, that'd be interesting. We'll see. I would, I would love that. But, um, yeah, maybe. I was feeling this on Sunday quite a lot. I feel like very, um, like, uh, what do you say? Like, I, uh, I feel like because I live in Australia, I'm like kind of separated from every, every blah, 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 blah. I'm kind of separated from everybody and it is very difficult to like, do anything with people uh because i'm just not around when other people are that's just how it's always gonna be you're just a pond jump to japan also would japan i don't think there would be any weebs in japan aren't weebs like Western folks that like Japanese culture. Um, but I don't know anyone from Japan <laughs> either. <laughs> there are otakus in Japan, right? Weebs in the West. I'd always be down for an early morning my time slash evening your time cozy game as long as I don't have homework or anything. That could be fun. I'm honored people are interested in playing a game with me. That, yeah, that's awesome. Is it morning my time? Yeah, it's like 10 a.m. I have to go to work in four minutes, actually. <laughs> so I should probably send you all on your way. But I'm glad I got this blocked out today. About five minutes till seven. Seven a.m. or p.m. Yeah. Thank you for the stream. You're very welcome. This is gonna be a fun one to um. P.m. Okay. It's gonna be a fun one to finish.
So yeah, this is the this is the uh, Spud Void Potato. Yeah, sweet stream as always. Thank you. Um, this is what we're going to be working with the next couple of days as I stream. Although I'm thinking of on Wednesday doing a. Oh, thanks for subscribing, Raz. I really appreciate it. Now you've got a bunch of emotes you can use. Um. Yeah, I know. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah, I think on Wednesday, which will be the next stream, I'm going to try playing a game, maybe. I think that could be interesting. Um, so yeah. I hope you all have a lovely after, uh, whatever time of the day it is. Uh, oh, no one's, no one is streaming right now. Okay. Well, in that, oh, wait. Uh, is sorry streaming? He said he would be streaming about this time. No, he's not. Okay, don't worry about it. In that case, I will talk to y'all next time. Thanks for thanks for coming today, everybody. Be safe at work, job. I'll do my best. I'll do my best. Thank you. You're very welcome. You're very welcome for streaming. It's been a pleasure. Alrighty. Later.